Bottoms up. Oh, God. Anyway, what is up, Crackhead Nation? It's your girl, Princess Galaxy, and today we are looking at my apartment. <laughs> so if you guys don't know, I moved at the end of May, and right now it is early June, and I decided to make a video about it because it's just a huge part of my life. It's the first time my boyfriend and I have stayed on our own, away from our families, not just together, but separately, just individually, and so I wanted to give you guys a tour of our unfurnished apartment. So let's do it. Let's go now. Because he is at work, he's actually the working man until I get a... <laughs> To, like another job so <laughs> don't skip any ads <laughs> all right let's look at the place to come in you will see a decadent orange right in front of you right in front of your feet so this is where i put my garbage here's a you can't really see it but it's like a it's like a closet and <laughs> okay so here's the thing cameron has more clothes than i do so we don't really know where to put our clothes yet and we don't have enough hangers to put his clothes anywhere. Also, we don't really have any furniture so we don't have any like drawers and stuff yet. So for now, we've just been putting a lot of stuff in bags and there's a random box, a random So here's basically his clothes and my hangers. I only have a few, but still. Obviously it doesn't make any sense that this is right next to the kitchen, but you know what? <laughs> We're making it. We're just doing what we can. <laughs> so here is the kitchen. Oh my god. I hate having the light on. Like I just the I don't know. I just don't like having it on. So but I guess I want you guys to see it. So maybe I should. Ugh, I don't know. Here's our Ooh, yeah, here's our refrigerator. And if you notice you zoom in, they're Charlie XCX albums. I found these magnets on Etsy. I mean not Etsy. Uh what's it called? Mercari and they sell them and someone was selling them and I was like um Cameron you will not guess what I got and he's like what and I'm like turn the XCX refrigerator magnets and he's like what <laughs> and here is our fridge we have we just went grocery shopping the other day and if you notice 90% of the things in our freezer are carbs so um but we still skinny legends so I didn't even when did he get this? I'm not eating that. That shit is nasty as fuck. And here's our Frigidaire. Wow. What's so full? Look at all these. Look at the alcohol. Look at the... Cameron calls these daiquiris? I do not think these are called daiquiris. What do you guys call them? It looks like it's pronounced dailies, but he calls them daiquiris, so I don't know if my boyfriend's stupid or not. We got some chicken titty. We got some ground beef. We love meat in this household. We have no choice but to stand. And we got a bunch of these. These are obviously my creation. They're beautiful and amazing. And actually, it was funny because the other day, I was drinking one of these and Cameron tilted it to the side like this. And when I came back home, it was spilt everywhere. Like it was truly, <laughs> truly traumatic. I've gotten this new obsession of cocktail shrimp. Well, Cameron's been in love with it forever, but I just had shrimp for like the first time in like my 21 years of living. So that's pretty iconic. Next we have our microwave that we just bought. So um, Cameron literally cannot live without a microwave because he's a boomer. So more stuff, mmm, chunky. Oh, these, oh my God, I have to show you guys these. So fucking good. These are craisins. And if you don't know what craisins are, you need to educate yourself. So they're basically like raisins, but they're not grapes. Craisins are dried cranberries, if you can't see by the front. And I literally am obsessed with them. They're so fucking good. And if I could, um, I feed them to my firstborn immediately. Can we talk about how small our oven is? Like this is the tiniest oven of all time. Um, also, here's our butter syrup. Um, just do normal butter. Don't try to get the light, like Tyler says. Some syrup, maple, whichever kind you like. Don't get the low calorie one. Here's. <laughs> plates they're like 
paper silverware i've had this silverware actually ever since i was in college well before i went to college because i thought i was gonna actually like have a dorm and stuff but i dropped out the first year <laughs> so <laughs> i guess i'm using them for my new place so the prophecy was fulfilled technically and also this is my magnum opus oh also i can finally buy red onions now because my mom didn't like red onions so take that mom i know you're watching this so anyway i got a keurig Woohoo! I've always wanted a Keurig. Ever since high school, I've always wanted a Keurig in my, whatever this is called, kitchen. Yes, kitchen. And honestly, I'm so happy and I have like the Coffee Mate things. I don't know why, but I've always been obsessed with Keurigs. And the last year of high school, we actually had a Keurig in our, cause I went to like a small private school. So they had the Keurig like in the morning. We have like a place where we go in the morning, kind of like a, a hall, not like a hall, but like a lunch room. Uh, and they had it in the lunch room and like, I used to always get some, even though the principal was like, princess, you can't have that. And then eventually halfway through the school year, she was like, you know what? Just take it, I don't care anymore. So that's what happens when you don't listen to authorities. And that is it. Oh, also <laughs> me Bud Light. Oh, yes, I love Bud Light, so good. Oh God. Bottoms up. Oh god. Okay. Let's look in the living room. So the living room is pretty disgusting. We got our we got our Wi-Fi and stuff set up. Odd V. I got my Rick and Morty bag right next to the garbage. Um sure. Also, the night we moved in, we found this by the garbage can. And Cameron was like, should we keep it? And I was like, sure. And it's basically about like family and like all this stuff and blah 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 and i was like oh my god it's a literal sign and he was like yeah that's why i wanted to get it it's the start of our new life <laughs> it's so beautiful <laughs> and this is our first official piece of furniture that we got for free from our friends so shout out to amy and alex we have no choice but to stand and here is a eight dollar lamp i found at target in indiana eight dollar this can we just talk about how this lamp is literally eight dineros? Like, way, like, what the fuck? Some of my K-pop albums right here. I was thinking about, cause this shelf was in my room, but I brought it out here into the living room because I was thinking like, maybe we can put like our awards and stuff on it. And obviously since I sucked at high school, the only awards I have are my fandoms. So I got my black pink light stick and a few of my EXO albums that I have left. And yeah, and here's the box for it. <laughs> did it, did it do. And also here's Cameron's Funhouse mirror. This mirror, guys, it's incredibly warped. Like, I know I look long. Damn, she's thick. Like, I'm not this long in real life. I'm eating good. <laughs> Next is my room. Well, our room and um, it's disgusting, so just a fair warning. So here's the room, literally my entire life is over there. We have no furniture yet, and we have a huge 65 inch television that we don't have a stand for. So whenever we wanna watch stuff on the bed, we have to be at the end of the bed in order to see it. So we have no choice but to stand. Clean clothes and some brand new pants that Cameron is not gonna end up wearing because he only wears like four of the pants that he has. The Xfinity box, GTA, which we love to play, and Xbox. I don't know why he got an Xbox, but PS4 for life is all I'm gonna say. <laughs> but I still play it though. I love playing GTA. I'm like addicted to it now. And here's my dirty clothes. I know you guys didn't ask for this. Also, if you see underwear, I'm sorry. I mean, I really don't give a shit. <laughs> Whatever. I keep saying like we just moved as like an excuse, but honestly, I don't have an excuse. And here's the bathroom. It's pretty gross. Um, it's actually a nice bathroom. You know, I've never had a bathroom where there's tiles on the mirror. I've never had that before. So I was like really happy about it. Sorry, if you see me looking, I'm looking at my face. You can't stop me loving myself. Ooh, ooh, I see John die. I just realized that I'd be seeing BTS today. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Turn the lights on, then you hurry. 
so obviously i just wanted to share with you guys kind of like where i was and I, um, can you like move um i wanted to show you guys like just how much my life has changed like ever since i started like this year you know i always like every year i always write down like the things that i want and the things that i intend and a lot of my things are coming true you know i'm in a great relationship and we have an apartment it's not furnished and it looks like we're college students attempting to survive but it's a start and honestly i can't wait to grow with you guys and just grow the channel and everything like super dope so it's just really cool and i just wanted to document the process i don't know how many views this is gonna get if it's even gonna be that popular but i'm gonna try to come out with two videos a week for now on every tuesday and friday at 10 a.m and um i'm really happy that i have more time on my hands to be able to make more videos and i have my own place because one of the reasons why i wasn't coming out with a lot of videos was because I was at my mom's and I had to do, I had to like take care of her and stuff like that. But um, now she's taken care of and um, yeah, I'm really, I'm just excited about everything. So let me know what you guys want to see and I will see you very soon. I love you so much. Bye. Um, bitch, I told you to move.